In fifth grade social studies, we're going to be learning about several different things. We are going to start the year off with focusing on maps. A lot of the fifth grade content has to do with being able to read a map and understand what a map is. So before we jump right in, we're going to review parts of a map and what maps are, how to read maps, different things like that. I went in and logged into Discovery Ed and you can see up here in the search bar, I just clicked on maps and it pulls up several different types of maps that you could potentially look at. There's world map, there's an ancient Middle East map, a topography map, oceans map, map of western expansion, a hurricane on a weather map, a physical map of the United States, a weather map that meteorologists would use, a physical map of East Asia, the U.S. population in 1880, and an empire map. You can do this same thing on Discovery Ed if you would like to see different types of maps. Obviously, they're going to show different things. So if I click here on the world map, it's going to pull up and show us a map of the world. Now, I can also come down here and read about this image. So it says a blue world map with grid lines on white backdrop 3D illustrations. So here's a map of the world, and hopefully you know that we are located in the North American content, continent, so it's right over here, and we are in the United States, and it's this center country right here. It's in between Canada to the north of us and Mexico to the south of us. So I'm going to go back here, and I'm going to click on another map. I'm going to click on the oceans map so we can look at the different oceans around the world. So here's another. You'll notice that the um, earth is shown here, and all of the different continents are labeled. And then we've got the Pacific Ocean over here, the Atlantic Ocean, the Arctic Ocean, the Pacific Ocean, the Indian Ocean, and that is it that's labeled on that map. So that shows you just the different water. And I'll click one more. I'm going to click on the physical map of the United States. Notice that this physical map here has different parts labeled. So I'm going to kind of zoom in just a little bit on it. You can see that the Appalachian Mountains are labeled, the coastal plains, the Rocky Mountains here are labeled, the Great Plains, the Canadian Shield, the Great Basin, the coastal ranges, coast mountains, different places like that. You can also tell over here we have our map key and it shows us elevation. So the places that are dark red, burnt orange, are going to be your highest elevation. And the regions that are in that purpley blue are going to be some of your lowest regions. It also shows on here the Pacific Ocean, the Atlantic Ocean, the Gulf of Mexico, and the Arctic Ocean. So again, this is just an intro into maps and kind of what they are. Feel free to take time to look at Discovery Ed and search up some of your own different maps to see what they look like.